So here we are with Snay Hall, uh, Paul Zeiss Lenses, and we're going to talk about some of the latest things that they're doing. And how you doing? I'm doing great, Michael. How about you? Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, I've been enjoying today. It's good talking to a lot of people. Uh, yeah. You know, blending into uh, one into the other. Good. So um, understood. Understood. I want to hear you know what you guys are up to at, at Zeiss and uh, you know how the year's been and and what uh, what you're showing here at uh, BandPro. At the BandPro event today, we're really concentrating on Cine applications. And actually, I'm a new hire at Zeiss, and I'm the sales manager for Cine Application in the Americas. So I'll really be dealing with any kind of camera system that's used for video or cinema work. You know, be it uh, A7S camera with the Loxia small lens on it, uh, up to you know Master Primes and Ultra Primes in terms of education. But those are sold through Ari. For the lenses I am responsible for is uh, compact zooms. Compact Primes, you know, the new Milvis line, Otis line. So I could kind of talk you through it, you know, what we sure. have. But it doesn't matter if you start off with the smallest of cameras, using an A7S Sony on a, for a crash cam or as a camera to shoot some cool nighttime stuff, you know. Yeah. We have a Loxia manual focus lens for that. We have Batis autofocus lenses, you know. The, the Loxia is better because, for video because it's manual focus with hard stops. Uh, if you go up to EF mount, you know, Canon mount, which is on a lot of different cameras from Amira to Mini to uh, the new Raven and Epic Dragons, you know, a lot of people are using it, C300s of course. What you can do is you can use our new Milvis lenses that we have, which are the newer versions of our classics basically, our classic line of lenses. So it's our classic uh, SLR lenses, Nikon mount or Canon mount. And if you really are want to push the quality level, you can get a lens that's really medium format quality in an SLR size, which is our Otis line of lenses. Now, all these lines of lenses, the Loxia, the Milavis, the Otis, even though they're made for still lenses, you could put rings on them and use them for, for cinema. Mm -hmm. You could actually put a 0.8 pitch gears on it, and you could put a follow focus and actually use it. And we're actually exploring ways to, in a kit, provide you with rings already that come from the factory that you can use. Because increasingly a lot of people are using these lenses, you know, for, for cinema and for video. And then if you really want to step up your game, you have the CP2 line, right, which a lot of people are using already. They already have the built-in rings on the lenses, iris and focus, their cinema quality housing, you know, you could use them on a film set. And on, uh, now we're going to have, um, we have the zooms as well. 15 to 30, 28 to 80, 70 to 200. Mm -hmm. The great thing about all of our cinema glass is two things. One, full frame coverage. So again, you're covered for the, hit, uh, the, the future. Because in the future, you will start seeing sensors that grow a little bit as you get more into 4K and 8K and stuff like that. So you need a large, larger image circle. So we have that covered. And all of our cinema glass, compact primes, super speed primes, and also our compact zooms, they all have multiple mount options. PL mount, EF mount, E mount, Nikon mount, whatever you want. Sure. So you can really use it on a lot of different cameras. So I think what our message is, is that we're future proof, got the full frame coverage, and at the same time, we have solutions for any kind of camera system you're using for professional use. Sounds great. Where can we learn more about Zeiss online, Facebook, Twitter, etc.? Yeah. Well, the, the best place to go for technical information is our Zeiss website. You go to Zeiss.com and there's a, a link for lenses. Yep. You could choose photography or cinema, so you can see both lines of lenses. And again, you could use a photography for cinema, but we separate the lines. Or you can, if you want a more of an emotional response or see camera tests or see what the public is saying, uh, we now have a website where we gather all our social media content, which is our Lenspire site. So instead of Inspire, you say Lenspire. Right. If you go to the Lenspire site, which is real easy to find on Google or lenspire.zeiss.com, you'll be able to see all kinds of great uh, content mm -hmm. of these lenses in the real world already being tested by our customers and partners so they can say better than we can sure. why they like the lens. Great. Yeah. We appreciate sitting down here at uh, BAMPRO, taking some time, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thanks a lot, Michael. Thanks appreciate lot. it. Great. Take care.